Hello everybody, Flame and Shark, back with another video today, giving you guys another blind commentary, blind reaction, and today we are reacting to Zootopia. That's right, we have a movie going on here, Disney movie, the 2016 animated film of the year, according to the Oscars, to the Academy Awards. Uh, yeah, I don't know. We'll see if it's, uh, hopefully it's good, it probably will be, Disney usually comes through. Um pretty well, and uh, I did a really bad job keeping up with Disney movies the last couple of years, which is good for you guys, because it means reactions. Ah, uh, disgusting. Alrighty, um, let's, uh, let's go, no, it's actually pretty good, but, um, yeah, I'm really excited for this, uh, the movie is about an hour 45, I think, but obviously that's counting credits, uh, so yeah, um, we'll see if I can get this in one record, in one cam recording or not, or more. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, this is part one of the 50k subspecial. Uh, I guess I should say what I know about this movie. There's talking animals. It's a, it's Zootopia. It's a city of talking animals. I don't know. I assume the whole world is talking animals, and I know nothing about the movie beyond that. I don't know why it's good or whatever, uh, I literally, I have no idea if there's any musical numbers in this, uh, I know there's, yeah, I, I don't know, I really know next to nothing about Zootopia, except that it's a bunch of animals that can talk, and it's like a city, or probably a world, but I think it focuses on a city of animals that can talk, I don't know what the storyline is, or anything beyond that, so, we're going in about as blind as one can be, pretty much. So uh, let me pull it up. It's a rather big file, so it might take a little, a few moments to load up, or or not. It could just load up super quickly. Never mind. What? Uh, just ignore me at all kinds. It's one forty-eight thirty-two. Uh, obviously, some of that will probably be uh, uh, credits and stuff. Uh, but anyways. I'm really looking forward to this. Hopefully, the you know guys don't mind the overlay. It's probably gonna be a bit smaller because it's movie. It's a movie, so it's in a different format, stuff like that. Anyways, let's jump into it. Zootopia. We'll commit. Yeah, it's a it's a 50k sub special. We'll do five counts for these. Zootopia. We'll commence in five, four, three, two, one, and play. Got a black screen. Oh, here we go. The Disney intro. Of course. This is super loud. I might have to turn it down more than normal. There's the uh, Ark and Disney. Do And the Walt Disney Animation Studio logo. Disney Animation Studios. Cool. Whoa. Whoa. This is a bit dramatic. I am going to turn it down, actually. Whoa. Okay, Zootopia. This is a bit quick. Fear. Treachery. Okay. Blood blood. All right. This Thousands is... of years ago, these were the forces that ruled our world. Fair enough. A world where prey were scared of predators. <sighs> and predators had an uncontrollable biological urge to maim and maul and... <laughs> okay, then. That's some good blood. So this is a play based on... Wow. 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 <laughs> so it's a play based on how animals the used to be. Divided in two. Vicious predator or meek prey. Wow. Wow, they spelled it wrong. But over time, we evolved and moved beyond our primitive savage ways. Now, predator and prey live in harmony. And every young mammal has multitudinous opportunities. Yeah. Because that's don't a have thing. I can't cower in a herd anymore. Instead, I can be an astronaut. 
astronaut. Nice. <laughs> I don't have okay. to be a lonely hunter anymore. Today I can hunt for tax exemptions. I'm gonna be an actuary. Of course. And this I music can make though. The world a better place. This is pretty cute. I am going to be a police officer. <laughs> yeah, they're like, oh, I don't want that. That is the most stupidest thing I ever heard. Wow. It may seem impossible to small minds. I'm looking at you, Gideon Gray. Oh, savage. Just 211 miles away stands the great city of Zootopia, where our ancestors first joined together in peace. Fair enough. And declared that anyone can be anything. Well, this is a really good message. I can already see where this is going. They're not. Judy, you ever wonder how your mom and me got to be so darn happy? Yeah, how was well, that? We gave up on our dreams and we settled. Right, Bond? Wow. Oh, yes, that's wow. Nice, we settled hard. See, wow. that's the beauty of complacency. Judy. Wow, okay, complacency. You you, you'll never fail. Wow, this is horrible. What your father means, hun, is it's going to be difficult. Impossible even for you to become a The animation's right. gorgeous, There's but it's a Disney a feature film. Never. What do we expect? Never. Well, she's got an epic flip. Or, um, heck, you know, you want to talk about making the world a better place. No better way to do it than becoming a carrot farmer. Yes. Huh. That's a dad, potato me, idea. 275 brothers and sisters. Of We're course. We're changing the world. Yeah. One carrot at a time. Amen to that. Sure. A noble profession. Mm -hmm. Just putting the seeds in the ground. One with the soil. And of course, they're going to be dicks. You get it. Yeah, I mean, it's great to have dreams. Yeah, just as long as you don't believe in them too much. What? Oh my god, these We're parents have the best advice of all time. I get why, but it's a little... Kick your meek little some would argue it actually isn't horrible out, advice, but bad, potatoes. Bad. What are you gonna do, cry? Hey, you heard her. Cut it out. Nice costume, loser. What crazy world are you living in where you think a bunny could be a cop? Kindly return my friend's tickets. Come and get them. But watch out, because I'm a fox. And like you said in your dumb little stage play, us predators used to eat prey, and that killer instinct's still in our dinner. Uh, I'm pretty much DNA. Sure it's pretty much DNA. Yeah, dinner. <laughs> Travis. Wow. You don't scare me, Gideon. <gasps> uh oh. Scared now? Look at her nose twitch. She is scared. Cry, little baby bunny. Cry. cry. Damn! <gasps> Savage. Ah, oh, you don't know when to quit, do you? <laughs> Obviously, oh, oh, whoa. I want you to remember this moment. The next time you think you will ever be Is that going to be a permanent scar? Carrot farming dumb bunny. Jesus. That, I know they cut away, but that was still pretty dark. I assume this movie's PG. I never actually looked it up. Here you go. Wow! Whoa, she so actually awesome. got it. You're awesome, Judy. Yeah, that Gideon Gray doesn't know what he's talking about. Well, he was right about one thing. I don't know when to quit. Nice! Okay, that's awesome. Oh, Zootopia Police Academy? Has 12 unique ecosystems. Oh, and now she's older. Tundra Town, Sahara Square. Of course. Yeah. name a few. You're yep. gonna have to master all of them before you hit the streets. Oh, guess what? You'll be dead! Damn. Savage. Sandstorm. You're dead, Bunny Bumpkin. One thousand foot fall. You're dead, character. But she never gives up. That's the key. You're dead, Palm Girl. Enormous criminal. <laughs> Enormous criminals. Wow! Just Love quit and go home, Fuzzy Bunny. Oh, what a shot. Never. Never. Just a stupid carrot farming dumb This bunny. is awesome. She's learning. And just dodge him. Yo! 
Use your own enemy's strength against them. Damn. As mayor of Zootopia, I am proud to announce that my Mammal Inclusion Initiative has produced its first Police Academy graduate, valedictorian of her class, ZPD's very first rabbit officer, Judy Hops. <laughs> Judy Hops. <clears throat> Assistant Mayor Bellwether, her badge. Oh, yes, nice. Thank you. Nice, that's it awesome. It is my great privilege. Interesting story so far. So she's going to be a cop in Zootopia. Zootopia. Precinct one, city center. City center. Congratulations, Officer Hops. I won't let you down. This has been my dream since I was a kid. You know, it's a, it's a real proud day for us little guys. Bellwether, make room, will you? Come on. Wow! Okay, wow! Hops, wow! Let's see those teeth. Right she's like hide. <laughs> Or like trying to get in the picture. Really that's great, you, Judy. Yeah, uh, scared too. Yes. <laughs> really, it's a kind of a proud, scared combo. Yeah. I mean, so that's not a bad thing. So, so far away, such a big Probably city. Probably 212 miles or whatever it was. Life. We know, and we're just a little excited for you. But everything will be fine. The only thing we have to fear. We only have a whole movie left. Wow. The only thing we have, to, thing we have to fear too. is fear so itself. Quoting Kennedy up in this biatch. You play cribbage yeah, with uh, a weasel. Yeah, and he cheats like there's no tomorrow. Of course. You know what? Pretty much all predators and Zootopia is full of them. Oh, yep. Stupid. And foxes are the worst. Yeah, oh, she so knows. Your father does have a point there. <laughs> it's in their biology. Remember what happened with Gideon Gray? When I was nine, Gideon yeah. Gray was a jerk who happened to be a fox. I know plenty of bunnies who are jerks. Uh, sure, yeah, we all do, absolutely. But just in case, we made you a little care package to take with mm -hmm. you. And I put some snacks in there. This is fox deterrent. Yeah, wow. That's safe to have that. This is fox repellent. Okay, wow. So deterrent and repellent. That's all she needs. Check this out. Oh, for goodness sake. Mm. She has no need for a fox that's taser. That's a bit oh, much. When is there not a need for a fox taser? <laughs> okay, look, I will take this. To make you stop talking. Terrific! Everyone wins. That's gonna end up saving her by the end of the movie. Call him that right there. Okay, gotta go. Bye. Aw, gotta get that hug in. I love you guys. Love you too. That's awesome. Oh cripes, here come the waterworks. All the rabbits are waving her off. Bye bye. This is great. Bye. Bunny Burrow, popular. <laughs> Jesus, Jesus. That is a lot of bunnies. Gazelle, try everything. Man, this scenery is gorgeous. I'm so used to TV animation. I haven't watched many uh, D Disney feature films in a while. They got 3D animation down to a science. It only takes like 8 million, and by 8 million, I'm, I mean a lot more than 8 million dollars. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that is gorgeous. This is literally Disney stroking themselves off for how beautiful this movie looks. That's the entire point of this scene. All the different climates and everything that Zootopia has. Yeah! Woo! Fishtown Market. Oh, that's so cool. Ugh. Oh. It would be cool to have a city that has every different type of climate. That'd be awesome. Oh. Wow. Gorgeous. Oh. Wow. This is awesome, guys. Gals. Everyone else. I might have a cut in the middle of the movie, or I might, um, 
I might try to go all the way, see if my camera can go that long. Put hamsters in their suits. Oh, nice. Juice bar. Everything. Welcome to Zootopia. Nice. And That's welcome ironic. Welcome to the Grand Pangolin Arms. Luxury apartments with charm. Of course. Complimentary delousing once a month. Don't lose your key. Thank you. Oh, hi! I'm Judy, your new neighbor. Yeah, well, we're loud. Don't expect us to apologize for it. Well, at least they're honest. I'm loud, too, but only when I'm reacting. And if... Fed. Crazy I feel like she's gonna say it's perfect. I yeah, love it. yeah, I saw that coming. Five thirty. Damn. Uh. Oh, she's gonna regret that. Maybe not day one, but she will regret. Is she gonna get it? Oh, interesting choice. Come on, he bared his teeth first. Mm, 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 mm. Excuse me. Mm. Hi. Oh, am goodness. They really did hire a bunny. <laughs> what? <laughs> I gotta tell you, you are even cuter than I thought you'd be. <laughs> Ooh, uh, you probably didn't know, but a bunny can call another bunny cute, but when other animals do it, it's, it's a perverted. <gasps> I am so sorry. Me, Benjamin Clawhauser, the guy everyone thinks is just a flabby donut loving cop stereotyping you. Oh, <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> You've actually, you've actually um, got, there's a, a in your neck, the fold, what? the, mm -hmm, there's. Oh, here you went, you little dickens. Oh. Yeah, he is a donut loving stereotypical so, cop. Which way do I? Oh, bullpen's over there to the left. Great. Thank you. Huh. Oh, that poor little buddy's going to get eaten alive. Uh, I don't think so. I think she's actually going to be the hero oh, of some crazy case or something. <laughs> Yeah, not only is it pretty much all all big animals, hey, but that's mostly dudes off. too. You ready to make the world a better place? Mostly. That looks like a chick at the end. <laughs> a ten hut. This guy reminds me. Alright. All right. Everybody sit. I've got three items on the docket. First, we need to acknowledge the elephant in the room. Francine. Oh, literally. Happy birthday. <laughs> wow. Number two. Nice. There are some new recruits with us I should introduce, but I'm not going to because I don't care. <laughs> Finally, we have 14 missing mammal cases. All predators, wow. from a giant polar bear to a teensy little otter. And City Hall is right up my tail to find them. This is priority number one. Assignments? Officers, Grizzoli, Fangmire, Delgato, your teams take missing mammals from the Rainforest District. Cool. Officers, McHorn, right of it. Let me guess, Ooh. everyone but your her is gonna get a Sahara team. Square. Officers, yeah. Higgins, Snarlow, Trunkerby, Tundra Town. And finally, our first bunny, Officer Hops. Parking duty. This man. Wow. Parking duty. A chief? Chief Bogo? Sir, you said there were 14 missing mammal cases. So? So I can handle one. You probably forgot, but I was top of my class at the academy. Didn't forget. Just don't care. Uh, yeah, sir, pretty I'm much. Some token bunny. Well, then writing 100 tickets a day should be easy. Damn. Gotta love that discrimination, man. Oh. I'm not gonna write a hundred tickets. I'm gonna write two hundred tickets before noon. <laughs> oh, savage! Well, you do not want her as your cop around town. Also, what the hell? Really? What? Oh wow! She's got the super ears. I can't believe we're giving a hero song to someone who's giving out tickets. 
nice to see at least that's a big car. Yo, what a badass. This is a bad bitch. She is way cooler than I'll ever be. I have no idea what they're saying. I just know when they say it. Ayo, I think. That's what it sounds like. Hey, watch where you're going, Fox. Uh oh. A fox is trying to do something stupid. Mm. Don't be don't be overly suspicious. He did look suspicious, but don't do anything without making sure that he's trying to steal something or do something bad. Oh God. <laughs> and a cherry on top. Listen, I don't know what you're doing skulking around during daylight hours. Oh. But I don't want any trouble in here. So hit the road. I'm not looking for any trouble either, sir. I simply want to buy a jumbo pop for my little boy. You want the red? Or the blue pal. That's BS. Such a... Oh, come on, kid, back up. Listen, buddy, what? There aren't any fox ice cream joints in your part of town? Uh, no, no, there are. There are. It's just my boy, this goofy little stinker, he loves all things elephant. Wants to be one when he grows up. What? Is that adorable? Who the heck am I to crush his little dreams, huh? Aw, this is cute. You, you probably can't read, Fox, but the sign says, we reserve the right to refuse service to anyone. So beat it. You're holding up the line. To be fair, it is true. <laughs> Hello? Excuse me. Hey, you're gonna have to wait your turn like everyone else, meter maid. Actually, I'm an officer. Just had a quick question. Are your customers aware they're getting snot and mucus with their cookies and cream? Oh, savage. Well, I don't want to cause you any trouble, but I believe scooping ice cream with an ungloved trunk is a class three health code violation. Which is kind of a big deal. Of course, I could let you off with a warning if you were to glove those trunks and I don't know, finish selling this nice dad and his son up. <laughs> oh, using your power in the quote-unquote right and quote-unquote wrong ways at the same time. Fifteen dollars. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? I don't have my wallet. <laughs> what a butt. I'd lose my head if it weren't attached to my neck. That's the truth. Oh, boy. I'm sorry, pal. And now you're gonna give the dude 15 bucks. Thanks anyway. And she's gonna get him the thing. Just, just, she, you have 15 bucks. We know you do. Keep the change. Cool. Officer, I can't thank you enough. So wow. Kind. What a really? nice uh, little potato. Oh, no. My treat. It's just, you know, it burns me up to see folks with... I feel like this guy's nice. totally gonna somehow be the big villain. A great dad and just a... A real articulate fella. Totally the villain. Well, that is high praise. It's rare that I or the love interest no or both. Officer Hops, Mr. Wild, Nick Wild. Nick Wild, eh? And you little guy, you want to be an elephant when you grow up? You be an elephant. Aww. Because this is Utopia. Anyone can be anything. <laughs> Debatable, but sure. Yeah, I tell him that all the time. All right, here you go. Two paws. Yeah. Wow. Oh, look at I'm that. I'm not even gonna oh, argue, to despite smile. the fact that right, that's give her a impossible. Bye, bye, toot, toot. <laughs> Bye now. Goodbye. Well, she's in a good mood now, so at least she made someone stay better. That's good. Oh, hey, little toot toot. Uh oh. What? Uh, what did you just-
just help him with? And then froze it and sold it? That is a scam and a half, oh man. And they just follow. <laughs> wow! <laughs> what an awesome system! And they actually threw their stick- what? There's even another part of the plan? Oh my god. This is some scam city Over shit. Delivery. What? With the color. The color. Uh, that's Redwood. Thirty-nine, forty. There you go. Way to work that diaper, big guy. Hey, no kiss, bye bye for daddy. Wow. Yeah, you're not. You kiss me tomorrow, I bite your face off. <laughs> oh, what a gangster! I stood up for you, and you lied to me. You liar. It's called a hustle, sweetheart. Yeah. And I'm not the liar. He's right. He is. Wow! Wow! What a badass! Slick Nick, you're under arrest. Slick Nick. Really? For what? Gee, I don't know. How about selling food without a permit? Transporting undeclared commerce across row lines? False advertising? Permit? Receipt of declared commerce? And I didn't falsely advertise anything. Take care. You told that mouse the popsicle sticks were redwood. That's right. Red wood with a space in the middle. Wood that is red. Wow! You can't what touch me, savage. carrots. I've been doing this since I was born. Oh. You're gonna want to refrain from calling me carrots. My bad. I just naturally assumed you came from some little carrot choke podunk, no? Uh, well, no. that actually is true. Well, Kathy and I grew up in Bunnyboro. Okay. Tell me if this story sounds familiar. Naive little hick with good grades and big ideas decides, hey, look at me, I'm gonna move to Zootopia, where predators and prey live in harmony and sing Kumbaya. Only to find, whoopsie, we don't all get along. And that dream of becoming a big city cop? Double whoopsie. She's Damn. a leader mate. And whoopsie number Damn. crazy, no one cares about her or her dreams. And soon enough, those <laughs> what dreams a savage. die. And our bunny sinks into emotional and literal squalor, living in a box under a bridge. Till finally, she has no choice but to go back home with that cute, fuzzy, wuzzy little tail between her legs to become... You're from Bunny Burrows, out you said? So how about a carrot farmer? That sound about right. What a savage. Uh, most of that was right, but the end result's gonna be better than you think, Foxy. Hey, hey, no one tells me what I can or can't be. Especially not some jerk who never had the guts to try to be anything more than a popsicle hustler. You don't know that. All right, look. Everyone comes to Zootopia thinking they can be anything they want. That included me, can't. right? You can only be what you are. Sly Fox. Dumb bunny. Damn. I'm not a dumb bunny. Right. And that's not wet cement. You'll never be a real cop. You're a cute meter maid, though. Maybe a supervisor one day. Hang in there. Wow. Wow. I don't even know what to say. This guy is amazing. The oh, poor girl. Back home. You and your basically nothing apartment in the big city. Everybody <laughs> wow, these songs. You can't do nothing right, I'm a loser. <laughs> Those just kept getting funnier and funnier. You should have played Let It Go. I mean, you do have the rights to it after all. Ugh. Yeah, not good. It's a carrot phone. Muzzle time. Oh, hey, it's my parents. Oh, there she is. Hi, sweetheart. Hey there, Jude the Dude. PB&J, did you see that? That's the Wi-Fi. Yeah, everything you ever hoped? Mm, absolutely. And more. Everyone's so nice. And more and indeed. I feel like I'm really making a difference. Wait a second. Holy cranks, Bonnie, look at that. Oh, my sweet heaven. Judy, are you a meter maid? 
Oh, this, no, oh, no, no, this is just a temporary thing. Oh, it's the safest job on the force. Oh, she's not a real cop. Our prayers have been answered. What a set. Oh, meter maid, meter maid, meter maid, Dad. Dad. meter maid. You know what? It's been a really long day. I should really. Right, you get some rest. They oh, are. Not gonna make themselves. Bye bye. They are so savage. Bye -bye. Those kid, those parents are like, we are so afraid that our daughter's gonna get killed. Morning, yeah, good idea. Leave the meter man alone. Didn't you hear a conversation? She feels like a failure. Oh, shut up. You yep. shut up. You shut wow. Up. <laughs> you sure you like the noisy roommates? Yeah, but it might be worse. It will be worse. That was 30 seconds over. Ugh, yeah, you're a real hero, lady. My mommy says she wishes you were dead. Jesus. This is true, but that doesn't make it uncool. I am a real cop. I am a real cop. You, buddy! Sir, if you have a grievance, you may contest your citation in traffic court. What are you talking about? My shop, it was just raw. Look, he's getting away. Wow, it's a little guy. Wow, you, what the hell? Well, she looks so much better when she takes that off. Catch me if you can, Cottontail. Wow. Well, I mean, if there's anyone you can catch, it's someone your size. This is gonna be a fun little chase scene, and there's some real cops. This is Officer McCorn. We got a 1031. Wow, stop it. If he gets away because of your overs. Why? A little hey, rotentia. Hey, Peter Man, wait for the real cops. Stop! Hey, I mean, this is her chance. Come on. I mean, it's not like you guys are gonna come in and crash little rodentia. Wow. <laughs> wow, this is really cool. <laughs> the set. Oh. Oh. Oh, what a save, yo! Oh! Oh! Sorry, coming through. Excuse me. Excuse me, pardon. Bon voyage! Wow, bon voyage. That's not how it's pronounced, but okay. Nice duck. Uh-oh. We got some mousetrap potatoes going on up in here. Yo! What a savage. The big donut. Hey, stop right there. Have a donut, Kappa. Wow. Oh my god, did you see the Mousies and Tarko. <laughs> All the horrible references. Oh, I love your hair. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Come to Papa. Ah. Nice! Okay, you're gonna have to be patient and wait in line just like everyone else, Mrs. What a capture. Okay? I popped the weasel! Pops! Yeah. Abandoning your post, inciting a scurry, reckless endangerment of rodents, but to be fair, you did stop a master criminal from stealing two dozen moldy onions. Nice. Mm. Hate to disagree with you, sir, but those aren't onions. Those are a crocus varietal called Midnicampum holocythius. They're a Class C botanical, sir. Well, I grew up in a family where plant husbandry was kind of a Shut thing. Shut your tiny mouth now! Sir, I got the bad guy. That's my job. Your job is putting tickets on parked cars. Uh, Chief, uh, Mrs. Otterton's here to see you again? Not now. Okay, I just didn't know if you'd want to take it this time. She seems wow. to live. What? Wow. Sir? You might want to take that. Who mate. knows what's I going on? I want to be a real cop do you think the mayor asked what i wanted when he assigned you to me but sir if life you... isn't some cartoon musical where you sing a little song it and actually your is dreams magically come true this is so disney let it go <laughs> so Just let it go please, five i feel like that was time. on purpose please. i'm sorry sir i tried to stop her she's super slippery of course she is she's the she's a beast Ma'am, as i told you we're doing everything we can. My husband has been missing for 10 days. His name is Emmett Otterton. Yes, I know. 
He's a florist. We, we have two beautiful children. He would never just disappear. Ma'am, our detectives are very busy. Please. There's got to be somebody to find my info. You're going to try. I will find him. Oh, thank you. <laughs> bless you, bless you, little bunny. <laughs> oh, she got a job. Take this. Find my Emmett. Mm. Bring him home. Take Interesting. Babies, please. So it's all about this kidnapping scheme is going to be really interesting. And he's going to get worse. One second. One second. I'm going to get mad at you. You're fired. What? Why? Insubordination. Now, I'm going to open this door and you're going to tell that otter you're a former meter maid with delusions of grandeur who will not be taking the case. I just heard Officer Hops is taking the case. Wow. <laughs> you got saved. really starting to pay off. <laughs> mayor Lionheart is just going to be so just. No, no, let's not tell the mayor just yet. And I sent it and it is done. It's so done. You have to deal with it. Get wrecked. I'd say the case is in good Get wrecked. Hops got a shot. We need to stick together, right? Like glue <laughs> good one yeah. just call me if you ever need anything ah that was kind of a dark <laughs> joke <City> Hall, Judy. <laughs> all right bye bye thank you ma'am and you got saved by the potato i will give you 48 hours yes That's fair enough two days to find emmett otterton okay but you strike out you resign oh uh go for it okay who cares? Deal. Splendid. All or nothing. Clawhauser will give you the complete case file. Here you go. One missing otter. There's barely That's anything. It? Yikes. That is the smallest case file I've ever seen. Leads none, witnesses none, and you're not in the computer system yet, so resources none. <laughs> oh, I hope you didn't stake your career on cracking this one. Okay. Last known Last known signing. That's the only thing you got. Dude, you're out of soda. Can I just borrow? Thank you. Popsicle. Oh, the murder weapon. Not quite. Popsicle. Yeah. Cause that. What does that mean? Is that Jonah yes. Fox? I. Wait, Jonah Hill. Jonah Fox. <laughs> I, I I got I got foxes on the brain right now. Hey, it's Officer Toot Toot. Oh, no. Actually, it's Officer Hops, and I'm here to ask you some questions about a case. What happened, Meter Maid? Did someone steal a traffic cone? It wasn't me. <laughs> hey, Carrots, you're gonna wake the baby. I gotta get to work. This is important, sir. I think your $10 worth of popsicles can wait. Ha! I make 200 bucks a day, Fluff. 365 days a year since I nice. was 12. Nice. And time is money. Hop along. Please just look at the picture. You sold Mr. Otterton that popsicle, right? Do you know him? I know everybody. And I also know that somewhere there's a toy store missing and stuffed animal. So why don't you get back to your box? What a savage. Fine. Then we'll have to do this the hard way. Did you just boot my stroller? Nicholas, how did she do it that much? Under arrest. Huh, for what? Hurting your free wings? Felony tax evasion. Oh, yeah. oh, $200 a day, 365 days a year. Since you were 12, that's two decades at times 20, which is 1,460,000, I think. I mean, I am just a dumb bunny, but. Yeah, I was also a valedictorian, yeah. Forms, you reported, let me see here, zero. Unfortunately, lying on a federal form is a punishable offense. Five years jail time. Well, it's my word against yours. 200 bucks a day. Oh, she just out savaged you. Yours. Yep. And if you want this pen, you're going to help me find this poor missing otter, or the only place you'll be selling popsicles is the prison cafeteria. Yeah, he's going to help you. It's called a hustle, sweetheart. <laughs> what a savage! What a savage! She hustled you good! Yeah. Help! You're a cop now, Nick. You're going to need one of these. <laughs> That was hilarious. I don't know where he is. I only saw where he went. Great, let's go. Yep. It's not exactly a place for a cute little bunny. Don't call me cute. Get in the car. Okay, you're the boss. Yeah, she is the boss, so deal with it. Some meditation place? What's going on here? Ooh. 
Ooh, this is... Speaking of beautiful scenery, holy crap. What the shit? <laughs> the pause button right there because we're all good on bunny scout cookies uh no i'm officer hops zpd i'm looking for a missing mammal emmett otterton right here who may have frequented this establishment <laughs> Ew. yeah old emmett <laughs> haven't seen him in a couple of weeks but hey you should talk to his yoga instructor I'd be happy to take you back. Oh, thank you so much. I'd appreciate that more than you can imagine. It'd be such a... Oh, you are naked. Huh? Oh, for sure. We're a naturalist club. <laughs> of course it's a naturalist club. In Zootopia, anyone can be anything. Yeah. And these guys, they'd be naked. Yeah, they'd be naked indeed. The other side of the pleasure pool. Oh, dear God. What on earth? Oh, boy. Does this make you uncomfortable? Because if so, there's no shame in calling it quits. Yes, there is. Boy, that's a spirit. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> yeah, some mammals say the naturalist life is weird. But you know what I say is weird? Clothes on animals. Here we go. As you can see, Nangi's an elephant, so she'll totally remember everything. Hey, Nongi, these dudes have some questions about Emmett the Otter. Who? Uh, Emmett Otterton? Been coming to your yoga class for like six years? I have no memory of this beaver. Wow, well, of course. He's an otter, actually? He was here a couple of Wednesdays ago, remember? Yeah, nope. what's going on yeah, here? He was wearing you a green cable knit sweater vest and a new pair of corduroy slacks. Yeah. Oh, and a paisley tie, sweet winds or not. Real tight. Remember that, Nongi? No. Yeah, we both walked him out, and he got into this so big either white she's... car with a silver trim. Needed a tune-up. The third cylinder wasn't firing. Wow, that that's a nope. lot. This that's is the guy with the perfect you memory. You happened to catch the license plate number, did you? Oh, for sure. It was 29THD03. 03, wow. This is a lot of great info. Thank you. Told you Nangi has the mind like a steel trap. Oh, I wish I had a memory like an elephant. Nice. Well, I had a ball. You are welcome for the clue. And seeing as how any moron can run a plate, I will take that pen and bid you adieu. The plate. I can't run a plate. Oh, I'm not in the system yet. Give me the pen, please. What was it you said? Any moron can run a plate? Gosh. If only there were a moron around who were up to the task. Oh, Rabbit, I what did what savage. you asked. You can't keep me on the hook forever. Not forever. Well, I only have 36 hours left to solve this case. So can you run the plate or not? Oh. Actually, I just remembered I have a pal at the DMV. Oh, interesting. Flash is the fastest guy in there. You need something done, he's on it. I hope so. We are uh, really see, fighting flash. the clock and every minute counts. Wait. They're all slots? Wow! The ultimate DMV joke! You know what's funny? Slots probably go faster than people at actual DMVs, so... I mean, or at least it's comparable time. I mean, this is... I feel like I could make... This could have been hilarious depending on who watched it. To me, it's just real. Like, this is just real life. Like, this isn't even a parody. Are you saying that because he's a sloth, he can't be fast? Yeah. I thought in Zootopia, anyone could be anything. Yeah. Flash, flash, 100-yard dash. Buddy, it's nice to see you. Nice to see you, too. Wow. Hey, Flash, I'd love you to meet my friend. Uh, darling, I've forgotten your name. Hmm. Officer Judy Hap, CPD, how are you? I am... Good. ...doing... Good. ...just... Fine. As well. Wow. As I can be. <laughs> wow. What? Hang in there. Can I do? Well, I was hoping you could run a plane for you. you. Yeah. Well, I was hoping you could. Today. Wow. 
Well, I was hoping you could run, run a plane. Yeah. We are in a really big hurry. Sure. What's the plate? Two nine. Okay, plate was the sync point. Two nine T H D. All right, guys. So I'm gonna cut here, and then I'm gonna record the rest of it in a flash. Okay, guys. Peace. Hello, we're back. Uh, I went back a little bit so I can sync it up with the uh, when uh, the Slossos played again. And uh, yeah, let's uh, let's do the rest of this movie. So uh, let's get back into Zootopia. Three, two, one, play. Well, I was hoping you could run a play for us. We are in a really big hurry. Sure. What's the plate? plate. Two nine. There we go. T Number. <laughs> oh, plate number. Two nine T H D zero three. This is amazing. Two nine. This is so T H D zero three. H D zero three. D. 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 Mm -hmm. Zero. Three. Zero. Three. Hmm. Hey, Flash, want to hear a joke? No! Sure. Mm. Like, what do you call a three-humped camel? What? A three-humped camel? I don't. No. No. Yeah. <laughs> what do you call, you call a three-humped camel? Uh, three-humped camel. Three-humped camel. Camel. Pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Ugh, that face! That is creepy as hell! Uh, 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 ah, yes, uh, very funny, very funny. Can we please uh, just focus on the text? Hey, wait, wait, wait. Priscilla. Oh, no. Oh, no! Oh, yes. no. Flash? Oh what? no. Do. No. You call. A three humped camel. Uh, pregnant. Okay, great. We got it. Please. Pumped. Wow, you actually got it. There you go. I wonder how long that took. I wonder if it's nighttime. Oh my god. Oh my god. Tundra Town limo service. I mean, it gives me plenty of time to. Here. from yes, yeah, Tundra yeah. Town. Thank you. Two night HDs are three. Go. It's registered to. Tundra Town Limo Service. A limo to Goderton and the limo's in Tundra Town. It's in Tundra Town! Way to hustle, bud. I love you. I owe you. Hurry! We gotta beat the rush hour in. It's night? That's how long it took. Yep. Closed. Great. Mm. And I will bet you, you don't have a warrant to get in. Hmm? Darn it. It's a bummer. You wasted the day on purpose. Madam. I have a fake badge. I would never impede your pretend investigation. This Damn, what a savage. Look, see? There's see, a lot of savage his going on. Otter is missing. Well, then they should have gotten a real cop to find him. What is your problem? Does seeing me fail somehow make you feel better about your own sad, miserable life? It does, 100%. Now, since you're... I wonder if she's going to end up using that fox sure. repellent on him or mm -hmm. something like that at some point. Because I've noticed it. On her right hip the entire time. Hey. Oh, what a savage. First off, you throw like a bunny. Second, wow. you're a very sore loser. See you later, Officer Fluff. So sad this is over. I wish I could have helped more. The thing is... Is she baiting you? I need you? a warrant if you have probable cause, and I'm pretty sure I saw a shifty lowlife climbing the fence. Oh. So you're helping plenty. Come on. What a savage! Three, this is it. Yeah, I gotta love when uh, cops are uh, uh, exercising their uh, rights very debatably. Polar bear fur. Got a full blown elementary up in here. Oh my god. What? What? The velvety pipes of Jerry Vole. <laughs> wow. What a savage. CD. Who still uses CDs? Uh. Uh oh. Carrots? If your otter was here, he had a very bad day. Oh my! Those are claw marks. Lots of them. Seen anything like this? No. Oh wait, look. Oh, things Someone just yep. Emmett Otterton. They just got a little serious. What do you think happened? 
Well, now, wait a minute. Polar bear fur, rat pack music, fancy cup. I know whose car this is. We gotta go. Why? Whose car is it? The most feared crime boss in Tundra Town. They call him Mr. Big and he Mr. Does not Big. Like me, so we gotta go. I'm not leaving. This is a crime scene. Well, it's gonna be an even bigger crime scene if Mr. Big finds me here, so we're leaving right now. And there's Mr. And Big's dudes. Kevin? Yep. Long time no see. Yep. And speaking of no see, how about you forget you saw me? Huh? Yeah. For old time's sake? That's a no. Uh no. They fell right into the thick of things, and that's pretty funny. <laughs> wow, selfies. Oh my god. That's pretty funny. What did you do that made Mr. Big so mad at you? I, um, I may have sold him a very expensive wool rug that was made from the fur of a skunk. But. Wow. Oh, sweet cheese and crackers. I know, man. I, I actually thought she was gonna say, oh, sweet Jesus. I don't know why. I, I don't know why that gets me in cartoons. It's like, I know better, but of course, it still gets me sometimes. And is Mr. Big really small, or is he not here? What's go Okay, there he is. is Mr. Big? No. Oh. What about him? Is that him? Mr. No. Big is totally hella tiny, isn't he? Or that's... Yeah, why did I know it'd be some little tiny dude? Mr. Big, sir, this is a simple mm. mistake. Yep, here. Mm. This is a simple misunderstanding. Kiss my mm. ring. You come here unannounced on the day my daughter is to be married. Well, actually, we were brought here against our will, so... <laughs> Point is, I, I did not know that it was your car, and I certainly did not know about your daughter's wedding. Mm. I trusted you, Nikki. I welcomed you into my home. We broke bread together. Grandmama made you a cannoli. Yeah. And how did you repay my generosity? With a rug made from the butt of a skunk. A skunk butt. This rug. guy is full blown godfather up in here. Me. You disrespected my grandmama, who I buried in that skunk butt rug. Wow. I told you never to show your face here again, but here you are, snooping around with this. What are you? A performer? What's with the costume? Sir, I am a co Mime? She is a mime. This mime cannot speak. You can't speak if you're a mime. No, I am a cop. <sighs> and I'm on the Emmett Otterton case, and my evidence puts him in your car. So intimidate me all you want. I'm going to find out what you did to that otter if it's the last thing I do. It probably will be the last thing she mm -hmm. does. Then I have only one request. Say hello to Grandmama. Jesus! I saw that yeah, is I didn't, dark. I didn't, I, didn't, I didn't see nothing. I'm not saying nothing. And you never will. Please. No, no, no. I saw. Oh God. Oh God. Daddy, it's time for our dance. What did we say? No, I sing anyone at my wedding. I have to, baby. Daddy has to. I saw. No, 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 no. <laughs> wow. Wait. Oh, it's the girl with the hair. Oh, yeah. I enjoy a donut. This bunny? Yeah. Hi. Hi. I love your dress. Wow, she's playing the game. Put them down. Wow. Wow. You're so... You've done me a great service. I will help you find the otter. I will take your kindness and pay it forward. Wow. And now she's got the deep, the, the, the freaking alliance with the gangster. And he's like, what? <laughs> wow. That's amazing. Oh, that's so cool. The poly bear's just chilling around. Hmm. <laughs> that fork. Otterton is my florist. It is good. He's like a part of the family. He had something important he wanted to discuss. That's why I sent that car to pick him up. But he never arrived. Because he was attacked. No. He attacked. Oh. Otterton. What? Otterton. He went crazy. Oh. Ripped this is interesting. Car, scared my driver. Wonder what was going on. And disappeared into the night. Huh. But he's a sweet little otter. Hmm. My child, we may be evolved, 
But deep down, we're all we're animals. Still animals. Yeah, this is true. You want to find out it and talk to the driver of the car. His name is Manchus. Lives in the rainforest district. All right. Only he can tell you more. Yeah, we gotta go to all the major districts that they uh, that they introduced. Mr. The rainforest Manchus? and the tundra. Hop, and the CPD. Desert. We just want to know what happened to Emmett Otterton. Let's see this driver. You should be asking what happened to me. Whoa. Jesus. Uh, Teetsy Otter did that? What happened? He was an animal. Down on all fours. He lost his mind. So there's something that's so turning savvy. people into animals. Oh. Terrifying. There was no warning. He just kept yelling about the night howlers. Oh, the night howlers, eh? The night howlers. Oh, so you know about the night howlers too. Good, good, good. Because the night howlers are exactly what we are here to talk oh, about. Oh, very smart. Right? Yep. So, uh, so you just open the door and tell us what you know, and we will tell you what we know. Okay. Nothing. That's what they know. Literally okay. nothing. Also, clever fox. Clever fox indeed. Mr. Monches? <gasps> oh, he's Are turning you? into a savage. Okay. Oh, the eyes. Run. That's the eyes of an animal. Oh, man. Derby. Interesting. So it somehow is spreading. Turning into uh, their 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 original potatoes. Interesting. Head down. Oh. Officer Hutch to dispatch. Are you familiar with Gazelle, greatest singer of our lifetime? And wow. Horns. Well, true. <laughs> okay, hold on. Keep watching. Who's that beside her? Who is it? Wow, you are one hot dog. Not quite. Claw Houser. <laughs> <laughs> Did you think it was real? It That's was called so a lot real. of editing. It's not. It's and really bad editing. Hold on a second. Claw Houser! Claw Houser, listen to me. We have a 1091. Jaguar gone savage. Fine, it's Hajunja. It's Tahunga. Oh, okay, we're sending back up. Ah. 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 All right. Head to the sky, trams. Oh, man. Come on, Hops. There you go. Oh crap. Is the box actually gonna save her? Get in. Carrots. Carrots. Go. Buddy. One predator. Two and up. Oh, what did she do? Nice! She now, cuffed him. A little tense, so I'm just gonna give you a little personal space. Yeah, good idea. Oh crap. At least you cuffed him. That's a big step. Rabbit, whatever you do, do not let go. I'm gonna let go. No, you what? No, One, say, you two. Go. You didn't say three, you potato head. Three. <laughs> Carrots, you saved my life. Aw. Well, that's what we do with the DVD. <laughs> <laughs> looks like I was wrong. It looks like he ended up being love interest as opposed to, uh, that looks awkward. Well, this should be good. It's pretty good. I thought this was just a missing mammal case, but it's way bigger. Mr. Otterton did not just disappear. I believe he and this Jaguar, they... They went savage, sir. Savage? This isn't the Stone Age, Hops. Animals don't go savage. I thought so, too. Till I saw... He's gone, right? Wow. What? He was right here. The savage jaguar. Sir, I know what I saw. He almost killed us. Or maybe any aggressive predator looks savage to you rabbits. Wow. Let's go. Wait, sir. I'm not the only one who saw him. Nick. You think I'm going to believe a fox? Well, he was a key witness, and I enlisted. Two days to find the otter, or you quit. 
that was the deal. Badge. But sir, we Badge! All right. So what's the fox going to do to stop her? To stop him? Uh, no. What did you say, Fox? Sorry. What I said was no. <laughs> no. I'll not be giving you that badge. <laughs> Look, you gave her a, a a clown vest and a three-wheeled joke mobile in two days to solve a case you guys haven't cracked in two weeks. Oh, what a savage! No wonder she needed to get help from a fox. None of you guys were gonna help her, were you? Here's oh. the thing, Chief. You gave her the forty-eight hours, so technically we still have. 10 left to find our Mr. Otterton. And that's exactly what we're gonna do. So, if you'll excuse us, we have a very big lead to follow and a case to crack. Good day. Damn, what a savage. Yeah. Yeah. Officer Hops. Wow, what a savage. He doesn't even know what to say. She doesn't know what to say. No one knows what to say. That fox repellent's gonna come into play. Maybe he's gonna see it and get offended. I don't know what. Thank you. <sighs> Never let them see that they get to you. So, things do get to you? Uh, I mean, not, not anymore, but. They used to. I eh? was small and emotionally unbalanced like you once. Har, har. No, it's true. I think I was eight or maybe nine, and all Whoa. I wanted to do was join the Junior Ranger Scouts. Oh, here we Someone go, the backstory. Put together enough money to buy me a brand new uniform because, by God, I was going to fit in, even if I was the only predator in the troop. Oh, the wow, fox, the absolute reverse. I was be part of a pack. Ready for initiation? Yeah, pretty much born ready. I was so proud. Okay, now raise your right paw and deliver the oath. I, Nicholas Wilde, promise to be brave, loyal, helpful, and trustworthy. Even though you're a fox. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, this. No, no, what did I do wrong, you guys? No, please tell me what did I do wrong? Thought we would ever trust a fox this is dark muzzle, as fuck. Yeah, you're even dumber than you look. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Wow, what the hell? That's sad. And, and now you're seeing the reverse of uh, the reverse of uh, things that day. the bunny. The reverse One. of uh, what's her name? I was never going to let anyone see that they got to me. Uh, Agent Hops. In two? If the world's only going to see a fox as shifty and untrustworthy, then that's what I'll be. No point in trying to be anything else. And that's you why. You are so much more than that. Just like I am. Boy, look at that traffic down there. How about we go out to Chuck in Traffic Central? Chuck, how are the things looking on the jam cams? Nick, I'm glad you told me. Wow. The jam cams. Seriously, it's okay. No, 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 no. There are traffic cameras everywhere, all yep. over the canopy. And that might what give the evidence. The, the traffic what? cams would have caught it. Bingo. Ha <laughs> ha, pretty sneaky slip. However, if you didn't have access to the system before, I doubt Chief Buffalo Bud is going to let you into it now. No. But I have a friend at City Hall who might. Oh. Oh, uh, sir, yeah, I was thinking her, but I wasn't sure. Sir. I'm so sorry. Sir. Okay, I heard you, Bellwether. Just take care of it. It's, uh, Please. I know his voice, but I can't think out. of the name. Oh, no, no, but sir, you do. For, uh, Lionheart. Sir, if I could just go, go. <laughs> oh, mutton chops. Assistant Mayor Bellwether, we need your help. Yep. Obviously, the assistant please knock. Traffic cam database. Traffic cam database. So fluffy. Hey, sheep never let me get this close. You can't just touch a sheep's wool. It's like cotton candy. Stop it. 
Where to? Uh, Rainforest District. Fine. Yeah, that's kind of awkward. Yeah. Traffic camps for the whole city. Well, this is so exciting, actually. I mean, well, you know, I, I never get to do anything this important. But you're the assistant mayor of Zootopia. It's oh, a... one more of a glorified secretary. Yeah, basically. I think mayor Lionheart just wanted the sheep vote. Yeah. Did you give me that nice mug? Oh. World's greatest dad, Feels assistant mayor. Appreciated. Smell weather. Ah, that's a fun Smell little name weather. he likes to use. I called him Lion Fart once. He did not care for that. Let me tell you, it was not a good day for me. Yes, sir. I thought you were going to cancel my afternoon. Oh. Dear, I better go. Let me know what you find. It was really nice for me to be. While well, we're young, smell weather. Wow. Wow. You think when she goes to sleep, she counts herself? Oh, shush. Okay, traffic cams. Tonga, Tonga. We're in. Yeah. Oh, 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 there's a van. Who are these guys? Uh, Timberwolves. Oh, Timberwolves, eh? Dum what did they- Whoa! <gasps> Bet you a nickel one of them's gonna howl. And there it is. I mean, what is it with wolves and the howling? It's- Howlers! Like... Night howlers! That's what Munchus was afraid of! Wolves! The wolves are the night howlers! If they took yeah. Munchus- Yeah. I bet they took Otterton too. Yeah. All we gotta do is find out where they went. Yeah. Wow, there's so many traffic cameras. Tundra Town Tunnel, okay. Rainforest District Tunnel. Wait, where'd they go? You know, if I wanted to avoid surveillance because I was doing something illegal, which I never have, I yeah, would well, never have done that. Six B, which would put them out right there. Yeah. Oh, look at you, junior detective. You know, I think you'd actually make a pretty good cop. Oh, how dare you! <laughs> I know, right? Case That's disrespectful. Ficus Underpass, South Canyon. Mm-hmm. They're heading out of town. Where does that road go? Left side. That's pretty awesome looking. Man, there's some shots that don't even look like they're animated. That's how good they look. Like the building is the only part of this that looks fake. <laughs> and even that doesn't, not by much. What the hell? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Careful. What is it? Gary, quit it. You're gonna start a howl. I didn't start it. <gasps> wow, it's like a natural instinct thing they can't stop. Come on. Wow. That's awesome. That's awesome. Yes, she is. Oh, man. Hmm? Getting inside. What do we got? <sighs> Gonna find some good stuff in here, I hope. It looks like this was a hospital. Yeah, probably. Ooh. I feel like something really bad's about to happen. Oh man, you know what's totally gonna happen? You know, he's, after you. the fox the is gonna become savage, and he's she's gonna totally use the repellent on him or something. That's probably what's gonna happen. Yep. So it's just genetic things that brings out the savage in animals. Yep. Saw this coming. Definitely some high tech potatoes. I bet you that's what it is. Like the part of the brain or something. Carrots. Oh my. Yeah. Huge, huge claw marks. I mean, what kind of- <gasps> That is terrifying. That is very terrifying. And those are all animals that have been savaged, and I bet you they're all different species. I bet it's one of every species they can get, right? Yeah, there's a bear. There's a kitty cat, or a different one, maybe. It is that guy. Otterton. It's him. We found our otter. Mr. Otterton, my name is Officer Judy Hobbs. Your wife sent me to find you. We're gonna get you out of here now. Or not. 
guess he's in no rush to get home to the missus. Yeah, and they've all gone savage. 13, 14. Not including Monches. It's... It's 14. Chief Bogo handed out 14 missing mammal files. These are all... They're all here. All the missing mammals are right here. Enough! I don't want excuses, Doctor. I want answers. Oh, Lionheart! Please. We're doing everything we can. What? Because I got a dozen and a half animals here who've gone off the rails crazy, and you can't tell me why. Now, I'd call that awfully far from doing everything. Sir, it may be time to consider their biology. This is why you what? need to cancel these What do you mean, biology? The only animals going savage are predators. We cannot keep it a secret. We need to come forward. Hmm, great idea. Tell the public. And how do you think they're going to feel about their mayor, who is a lion? I'll be ruined! Well, what does Chief Bogo say? Chief Bogo doesn't know. And we are going to keep it that way. Someone's here. Sir, you need to go now. Security sweep the area. Mom and Dad had to call. Damn. Great, we're dead. We're dead. That's it. I'm dead. You're dead. Do the toilet. Dead. Flush yourself. You swim. What? Can I swim? Yes, I can swim. Why? Oh God, that's uh, one of these like tasers with. Big fall. They're gonna survive it, though. Oh wow, she actually went. She went to perfect form. Let me guess. How much do you want to bet her phone is broken? Oh, you genius! I saw the back. Didn't even think about it. Oh my god. She is amazing. Chief Bogo. No, no. Wait, is that Gazelle? No. I'm Gazelle, and you are one hot dancer. You have the app too. Oh, Hauser, can't you see I'm working on the missing mammal cases? Oh, 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 yes, of course. About that, sir. Officer Hops just called. She found all of them. Wow, I'm impressed. Oh, right on cue. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Lionheart, you have the right to remain silent. And you wow. don't understand. I was trying to protect the city. You were just trying to protect your job. No, listen, we still don't know why this is happening. It could destroy Zootopia. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used. He's just like chilling. <laughs> Junior detective, bitch. Ladies and gentlemen, mammals. 14 mammals went missing, and all 14 have been found by our newest recruit. We will speak to you in a moment. But first, I'm so nervous. Okay, press conference 101. You yep. want to look smart, answer their question with your own question, and then answer that question like this. Excuse me, Officer Hops. Uh, what can you tell us about the case? Mm. Well, was this a tough case? Yes. Yes, it was. You see? You should be up there with me. We did this together. Well, am I a cop? No. No, I am not. I am awesome, though. Funny you should say that. I am. Because, uh, well, I've been thinking, it would be nice to have a partner. Oh, that's awesome. Here. In case you need something to write with. Uh, the pen. Aw, that's so cool. Officer Ops, it's time. It's to be in good health, physically <laughs> as emotionally. So now, I'll turn things over to the officer who cracked the case. Officer Judy Hops. All right, Judy. And everyone's like, Judy. Over here, over here. Yes? What can you tell us about the animals that went savage? Well, the the an the animals in question um, are they all different species? Yes, yes, they are. <laughs> okay, so what is the connection? Oh, all we know is that they are all members of the predator family. So predators are the only ones going savage. That is ac yes, that is accurate. Yes. Why? Why is this happening? We still don't know. But, uh, it may have something to do with biology. What do you mean by that? A biological component, you know, something in their DNA. In their DNA? Can you elaborate this on that? Yes. Time I mean to is, stop talking. Thousands of years ago, um, predators 
survived through their aggressive hunting instincts. For whatever reason, they seem to be reverting back to their primitive savage ways. And now he's scared. Oh, of course, he sees the, and he's having the flashbacks. It is possible. So we must be vigilant. And we at the ZPD are prepared and are here to protect We're you. We're more mammals, go stop it. What is being done to protect us? Have you considered a mandatory quarantine on predators? Okay, thank you, Officer Hops. Uh, that's all the time that we have. No more questions. Yeah, is the assistant mayor the... Was I okay? Temporary I mayor? Fine. Oh, that went so fast. I didn't get a chance to mention you or say anything about how we... Oh, I think you said plenty. What do you mean? Clearly, there's a biological component. These predators may be reverting back to their primitive, savage ways. Yeah, he's Are a predator, too. Did I just forget? stated the facts of the case. I mean, it's not like a bunny could go savage. Right, yeah, but a fox could, huh? Nick, mm. stop it. You're not like them. Oh, there's a them now. Uh, you know what I mean. You're mm. not that kind of predator. Racism. The kind that needs to be muscled? The kind that makes you think you need to carry around hardcore racism. Me. Yeah, don't think I he know exactly brought it the up. There it is. So l let me ask you a question: Are you afraid of me? Do you think I might go nuts? You think I might go savage? You think I might try to eat you? <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! Just when I thought somebody actually believed in me, huh? Probably best if you don't have a predator as a partner. Oh my God, this is, this is some shit. And he filled it out too. Nick, Nick. Officer Hop, were you just threatened by that predator? No, he's my friend. We can't even trust our own friends. That is not what I said, please. Are we safe? Have any other foxes gone savage? More bad news Wow. In city gripped by fear. A caribou is in critical condition, the victim of a mauling by a savage polar bear. This, this the 27th such attack, is not good. comes just one week after ZPD officer Judy Hopps connected the violence to traditionally predatory animals. Meanwhile, a peace rally organized by pop star Gazelle was marred by protests. Interesting. Go back to the forest, predator! I'm from the savannah! Zootopia is a unique place. It's a crazy, beautiful, diverse city. Mm. Where we celebrate our differences. This is not the Zootopia I know. Exactly. The Zootopia I know is better than this. We don't just blindly assign blame. Racism. This is a lot. This is social commentary is, a lot stronger than I would savage. have expected. Wow. Not just racism, really every ism. But we cannot let fear divide us. Please give me back the Zootopia I love. Mm. Go for it, Gazelle. Come on, Hops. The new mayor wants to see us. The mayor? Who's the Hi. mayor? It would seem you've arrived. <laughs> Apparently. And who is the new mayor? Clawhauser? What are you doing? Um, they thought it would be better if a predator such as myself wasn't the first face that you see when you walk into the ZPD. Aww. What? That sucks. They're gonna move me to records. It's downstairs. Wow. It's by the that sucks. Hops! If anything, it kind of she kind of this this incident has reversed the racism, which makes me think. I don't understand. She might. Well, our city the is villain is either her or. Right now they're just really scared. It's either her You're or the the little and so the little mouse right. dude, Chief or it's it's got to be a prey that's want behind you this. To be the public face of the ZPD. I'm. Not. I'm not a hero. Mm. I came here to make the world a better place, but. And things aren't working out the way I imagined. Like it. Don't give yourself so much credit, Hops. <laughs> the world has always been broken. That's why we need good cops. That's true. That's Thank so you. true. Wow. There you go. With all due respect, sir, a good cop 
is supposed to serve and protect, oh. help the city. Wow. Not tear it apart. Police commentary too. This movie is going all the directions. I don't deserve this badge. Wow. Oops. Judy, you've worked so hard to get here. It's what you wanted since you were a kid. You can't mm. quit. Thank you for the opportunity. Oh, is she gonna go home to uh, Bunny Burrow now? Damn. Shit. Well, that sucks. Jeez. Yeah, she she totally went back to Bunny Burrow, didn't she? A dozen carrots. Thanks. Have a nice day. She looks good. You barely recognize her, though. They're gonna have to convince her to go back, aren't they? Hey, Jude. Jude the dude. <laughs> Remember that one? Jude the dude. That, that kind of doesn't work. I'm fine. You are not fine. Your ears are droopy. <laughs> yeah. This is true. I think I can make a difference. Because you're a trier. That's why. You've always been a trier. <laughs> oh, yep. I tried. And it made life so much worse for so many innocent predators. Oh, not all of them, though. Speak of the devil, right on time. Gideon Gray. Is that Gideon Gray? <laughs> yep, it sure is. We work with him now. He's our partner. And we never would have considered it had you not opened our minds. That's right. I mean, Gid's turned into one of the top pastry chefs in the tri boroughs That's really cool, you guys. Gideon Gray. I'll be darned. Hey, Judy, I, I'd just like to say I'm sorry for <laughs> the way I, I, I behaved in my youth. I, I had a lot of self-doubt, and it manifested itself in the form of unchecked rage and aggression. I was a major jerk. Oh, I know a thing or two about being a jerk. Anyhow, I, I brought y'all these pies. Hey, kids, don't you run through that Mindy Camp from Holly Scythius. Well, now, there's a $4 word, Mr. H. My I know, right? just call them night howlers. <laughs> night howlers? What did you say? Oh, Gid's talking about those flowers, Judy. I use them to keep the bugs off the produce, but I don't like the little ones going near them on account of what happened to your Uncle Terry. Yeah, <gasps> Terry ate one. That's what makes him savage. Completely nuts. He bit the dickens out of your mother. Oh, shit. A bunny can go savage. Savage was well, a strong word, but it did hurt like the devil. Well, sure it did. There's a sizable divot in your Anyone arm. Anyone can. I call that savage. Night howlers aren't wolves. They're flowers. The flowers are making the predators go savage. That's it. That's what I've been missing. Oh, keys, 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 keys. Hurry, right, come on. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I gotta get to Zootopia this instant. Wow. You catch any of that, Bond? Not one bit. Yeah. Well, that makes me feel a little bit that better. That figures I, I it out. she was talking in tongues or something. Well, sure enough, how about that? The person that made her, she had her aha moment because of the person that gave her the scratch when she was a kid. Man, that's such an awesome looking city. That's dark as hell. Who is it? I need to find Nick. Please. Yeah. Nick? Nick, where are you? Oh, Nick. Night howlers aren't wolves. They're toxic flowers. I think someone is targeting predators on purpose and making them go savage. Wow. Isn't that interesting? Oh, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Wait, uh, wait, please. I, I know you'll never forgive me, and I don't blame you. I but I need your help. Either. I was ignorant and irresponsible and small-minded. But predators shouldn't suffer because of my mistakes. I have to fix this. But I can't do it without you. And, mm. and after we're done, you can hate me. And, that, and that'll be fine because I was a horrible friend mm. and I hurt you and you and you mm. can walk away knowing I ship it so hard right all along I really am just a dumb bunny damn savage that's I really am just a dumb bunny wow I really am just a dumb bunny don't worry carrots I'll let you raise it 
in 48 hours. <laughs> All right, and a kiss. Maybe sex, but at least a kiss. Oh, I didn't realize the disparity in their height until so just now. Emotional. There we go. Deep breath. Are you, are you just trying to steal the pen? Is that what this is? Oh, you are standing on my tail, though. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. Ooh, I thought you guys only grew This carrots. movie's amazing. Mm. What's your plan? We are going to follow the Night Howlers. Okay. How? Know this guy? Uh-huh. I told you, I know everybody. <laughs> well, hello, step right up. Anything you need, I got it. All your favorite movies. Wrangle, Wreck-It Rhino, Pig Hero 6, Mool. 15% off. 20. Float and Take me an offer. Come on. Wow, well, they just well, referenced well, all of their is. Disney movies. The Duke of Bootleg. What's it to you, Wild? Shouldn't you be melting down a popsicle or something? Hey, if it isn't Flopsy the Copsy. We both know those weren't moldy onions I caught you stealing. What were you going to do with those night howlers, Weaselton? It's Weaselton. Duke Weaselton. And I ain't talking, Rabbit. And ain't nothing you can do to make me. Oh, uh, there's a lot she can do. Ah, yeah, that'll work. <laughs> you dirty rat. Why are you helping her? She's a cop. And the godmother to my future grandmother. The godmother. I'm gonna name a Judy. Oh. <laughs> Ice this weasel. <laughs> the Alliance. I stole him night house so I could sell him. They offered me what I couldn't refuse. Money. Money. What a shocker. A ram named Doug. We got a drop uh. spot underground. Just watch it. Doug is the opposite of friendly. I He's swear, unfriendly. the only person left it could be unfriendly. Wow, the only person left that could be the villain. It has to be someone we know, so it has to be the girl, the mayor. That's the only character left that could be the big plot twist villain. Because Disney likes to do that, and it's the only character left. If it's anyone else, I'll be surprised. Yeah, it looks like old Doug's cornered the market on Night Howlers. Yeah, that's, yeah. Totally. They're totally working for the mayor. I think I got it. I think I got it. That's the only person it could be. And, and given, I mean, given the species of this potato, it makes perfect sense. We got Doug here. What's the mark? Cheetah and Sahara Square. Got it. Oh, it's a... Uh... Yeah, I know they're fast. I can hit them. Listen, I hit a tiny little otter through the open window of a moving car. Oh, shit. He brews it and then he assassin is he's an assassin with it. No. Doug, you're a I'll savage. You when it's done. Or you'll see it on the news, you know, whichever comes first. Hey, Doug, open up. We got your latte. All right, Walter and Jesse are back, so I'm leaving now. Out. Hey, where are you going? Where are you going? Get back here. What are you doing? He's going to see you. What are you looking at? Hey, whatever you're thinking, stop thinking it. Carrots. Uh, no. Carrots. Carrots, Carrots is going to make Better a big move. Better have the extra foam this time. <laughs> Yo! What are you doing? You just trapped us in here. We need to get this evidence to the ZPD. Okay, great. There it is. Got it. No. All of it. Wait, what? What? That's a train? Oh, great. You're a conductor now, huh? Yeah, apparently it she would is. It's a miracle to get this rust bucket going. It's going. Well, hallelujah. We I know, right? got a situation at the lab. Oh, it just got worse. Mission accomplished. Would it be premature for me to do a little victory toot toot? All right. One toot toot. <laughs> well... I can cross that off the bucket list. Yeah, but now it's funny that he actually wanted to do a toot toot. Uh oh. Wow. Uh oh. Bad idea. I may have to rescind that victory toot toot. Yeah, I know, right? This is bad. Maybe that's just hail. No, it's worse than that. Back off. Don't. 
Oh boy. Incoming. Nice. Oh, they nailed each other. Karen, Come on, Judy. Stop. Keep going. No, no, please stop. Do not stop this car. Ah. Wow. You're lucky you didn't die, dude. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. Speed up, Nick! Speed up! There's another train coming! Trust me! Speed up! Stop the train! Hey! Need some help? Holy crap! Oh, Jesus! Oh, man! Also, the sparks flying and crap, it's gonna blow! Oh, crap! Is all the evidence gonna blow up with it? Oh, crap! Oh. Okay, maybe. Uh, maybe so close. Survived. Nope! You probably. Oh, Jesus! Talk about jinxing it, you potato head! Wow! Get wrecked. Everything is gone. We've lost it all. Yeah. Oh, except for this. <gasps> yes! <laughs> oh my god, Nick, you're Mom, the king. We gotta get to the CPD. Judy, Nick, Judy, we Nick, get it. Museum. Wow, Natural History Museum. That's ironic. You better hope he doesn't have a gun, another gun to shoot. Oh, oh there it is. Oh god, he's gonna get shot. Or... Judy! Bullshit. Hey, no Bullshit. That's the villain. That's the villain. We found out what's happening. Someone's starting predators with a serum. That's what's making them go savage. I'm so proud of you, Judy. Nope. You did just a super job. Thank you, ma'am. <sighs> she figured it out. How you know where to find us? I'll go ahead and I'll take that case now. Uh, you know what? I think Nick and I will just take this to the ZPD. <laughs> Uh oh. Run. Run. Yeah. Yeah. Get them. Yeah. 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 I felt like that was kind of predictable, but still. Uh, carrots. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. He's got to go on his own, doesn't he? What? Blueberry? Uh, pass. Hey, I'll, I'll still eat it. I'm not gonna leave you behind. That's not happening. I can't walk. Just, we'll think of something. We're on the same team, Judy. No, you're, you're not. Estimated, underappreciated. Mm, yeah, it makes sense. She has the motivation to be a villain. Yep. Predators. They may be strong and loud, but prey outnumber predators ten to one. This is true. Also, whose voice is that? I just recognized that voice. Think of it. 90% of the population united against a common enemy will be unstoppable. Yeah, that's not the case. Huh? Wow. Over there! Wow. Wow. No. Oh, crap. Is the case gonna make it to... Is that the... It, Oh, where's the where's the freaking chief of police? Where's the freaking <laughs> crap? Well, you should have just stayed on the carrot farm, huh? It really is too bad. I I did like you. What are you going to do? Kill me? Oh, no, of course not. <laughs> he is. Oh no! no. Oh, Nick? No. Yes, oh, it's please. totally. There's a did he somehow switch it out? Natural History Museum. Is it a blueberry? No. Is it a blueberry? Please be a blueberry. Oh, Please be a blueberry. He can't help it, can he? Since preds are just biologically predisposed to be savages. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! Oh God! This. Gosh. This is. Headline. This is horrible. Hero cop killed by savage fox. So that's it. Prey fears predator and you stay in power? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. It won't work. Fear 
always works. And I'll dart every predator in Zootopia to keep it that way. <laughs> He's faking. No. He's faking. He's faking. <laughs> bye bye, buddy. He's faking. Blood, 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 and yes. All right, you know what, you're milking it. Besides, I think we got it. I think we got it. We got it up there. Thank you, Yakky. It was a blueberry you after it all. all. Beautifully. What? Yeah, oh, are, they are recorded her. Serum? They recorded her. Well, it's right here. Well, you've gotten the weapon there? Those are blueberries. Oh, oh family shit. Farm. Mwah. They are delicious. You should try some. Ugh. I framed Lionheart. I can frame you, too. It's my word against yours. No, it's your word against Actually, yours. <laughs> and I'll dart every predator in Zootopia. <laughs> <laughs> it's your, your word, word against, against yours. yours. <laughs> it's called a hustle, sweetheart. Boom! Boom. Get wrecked. Former Mayor Dawn Bellwether is behind bars today, guilty of masterminding the savage attacks that have plagued Zootopia of late. Her yeah, now, now you Leodore get to go Lionheart in prison with a bunch of... Uh... Any knowledge of her plot, claiming he was just trying to protect the city. Did I falsely imprison those animals? Yes. Well, yes. Yes, I did. It was a classic doing the wrong thing for the right reason kind of a deal. In the yeah. news, doctors say the night howler antidote is proving effective in rehabilitating the afflicted predator. And that includes the uh, the otter who gets to be with his family. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Gotta have a good old Disney happy ending, right? Oh, my back's killing me. Mm. Good job. When I was a kid, I thought Zootopia was this. No, all we need is a kiss. We're not gonna get where everyone got along and. Anyone could be anything. Pretty much. Turns out, I was right. Life's a little bit more complicated than. But a you were still right, Mian. Real life is messy. Yes, this is also we true. All have limitations. We all make mistakes, which means, hey, glass half full. We all have a lot in common. Yep. And the more we try to understand one another, the more exceptional each of us will be. Yep. But we have to try. Yep. So no matter what is she the new police chief? Have, from the biggest elephant to our first fox. Oh, very nice. I implore you. Try. try Never to give make up. The world a better try place. to make exactly. This is such yourself a great that movie. Starts with you. And that's not even talking about how good the it social commentary in this movie is. It starts with all of us. All right, all right, enough. Shut it! <laughs> yeah, he's a we savage. We have some new recruits with us this morning, including our first fox. I don't care. Who cares? Huh? You should have your own line of inspirational greeting cards, sir. Shut your mouth, Wild. <laughs> Assignments. Officers Grizzoli, Fangmire, Delgato, Tundra Town SWAT. Of course. Narlov, Higgins, Wolford, Undercover. Yep. Ops. Wow. That was great. Parking duty. Dismissed. Just kidding. <laughs> we have reports of a street racer tearing up Savannah. Ah, uh, there you go. Find him. Street race Fucking time. Down. So are all rabbits bad drivers, or is it just you? <laughs> All rabbits Oops. are bad drivers. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sly bunny. Yes. <laughs> you Don't love box. me. Do I know that? She does. Yes. Oh! Yes, I do. Oh, 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 oh. I'll take it. Wow. Wow. I will take it. They admit it they love each other. That's enough for me. Fast. Sir, you were going 115 miles per hour. I hope it's you have a good explanation. <laughs> flash, wow. flash, 100 yard dash. <laughs> hey. Oh, of course. Good evening, Zootopia. Oh, we got a gazelle thing. Put your paws up. I messed up tonight. I lost another fight. I still miss her, but I'll just start again. Of 
Mars. <laughs> I'm going to turn it down from, uh, from 60 to 25 so I can actually talk over this, but, um, that's Utopia, ladies and gentlemen. And it was brilliant, and that was cute. Very cute movie. Awesome. I loved it. So good. Wow. Um, so I'm mostly just gonna let the uh, credits roll. Jeff Chasson has a story, head of animation, co-head of animation, director of cinematography, layout, lighting, and technical supervisor. Wow. 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 She is really depressed. All these people who work so hard on this great movie. Um, I know it's kind of boring, even in song, even with this song, but they deserve the credit. Oh, this is the Try Everything song. Try Everything. Addison T. much to say um the social jason bateman of course that was him i don't know how i didn't recognize jenny slate don't know who that is yeah jk simmons of course i should be able to recognize his voice every single time and be able to say it's jk simmons oh that was shakira that makes sense. I knew it was the singer who I knew, but now I know. All right, now back, now to regular credits. Jennifer Goodwin, Jason Bateman, of course, Idris Elba. Yeah, Mary Lionheart was J.K. Simmons. That was dead obvious. How did I not immediately catch on to that? Who the heck is Fuchsia? Oh, Kristen Bell was in this. Oh, this was fun. Uh, there's not going to be any post commentary on this because I think everything I need to say I can say right now. Uh, and what I do want to say is that uh, it was a fun movie and uh, very much worth the watch. Um, I don't know if it was the best animated film of the year, but it very well might have been. I can see why it won um, at the Gemmy Awards and... Uh, yeah, it's another great Disney movie. Um, they get some wrong, but they get a lot right, especially their original films. Um, 
they're not good at sequels because sequels a lot of stuff just isn't meant to have a sequel but uh this was this was really awesome um i enjoyed the heck out of it it was great what else needs to be said um definitely a movie i'd recommend everyone to watch very fun Uh, there will be a movie tomorrow, an anime movie, and another cartoon movie on uh, Friday. But yeah, for now, this was awesome. And uh, I hope you guys all enjoyed it. I sure as heck did. Not much else to say though. It was just a really fun movie. And uh, like I said, the social commentary was brilliant and everything was great. And it was just so much fun. Um, and I just loved it. Like, I don't know how else to say it. It was, it was a really good movie. Uh, the, the interactions between Judy and Nick were really great. Uh, the plot made a lot of sense, uh, the inevitable villain, uh, made a lot of sense to the point to where I figured it out before it happened, but I could also see it being a plot twist for some people. Uh, I'm just really experienced with Disney, so, uh, th this was one of those where the big villain was, was, it was kind of a murder, not a, a murder mystery, even though there was no murder involved, so... And I'm really familiar with those, so I'm pretty good at predicting, like, who the bad guy is. It took me a while, but, uh, I did figure it out before it became obvious, in my opinion. So that's cool. Uh, the score was really good. Uh, the score playing right now is also really good, even though I have it turned down a little bit. I can still hear it quite well in the background. Cause since it's just score and no dialogue, it works well at this uh, volume. Yeah, there was one more time, everybody hurts. Try everything, of course, all by myself. Yeah, <laughs> parlez-vous rap. <laughs> I loser, that was great. <sighs> Very funny. Skywalker Sounds, Lucasfilm, Limited co Company, interesting. Post-production sound from them, eh? I guess, technically, uh, there is relation with Disney there, so... Makes sense. Um... The one thing I do like about the credits is I don't have to have a super long outro because I get to talk all about my uh, thought potatoes during the credits. And I just get to keep the credits in and it works in those regards, which is really cool. Uh, but yeah, really good stuff. I This movie was so cool. Like, Disney never ceases to amaze me in their ability to make awesome movies. Um, it's just, you know, the creativity, and it's just so cool, like, like, and this had a lot of basic uh, plot elements in it, yet it still felt like such a creative movie, and it, it came out at a great time in regards to, obviously it came out last year, but you get the point, it came out at a great time in regards to what it was talking about, about not judging books by their cover, about uh, anyone can do whatever they put their mind to, there was a lot of, um, of uh, political issues that were touched on in this uh, movie. And uh, while it's not a necessary uh, component to making a great series or movie or whatever the whatever form of media you're making, it's something that, uh, if done correctly, will only enhance the product uh, to issue, if it, it touches on issues that are important to our society, especially at the time that it comes out. And uh, Zootopia definitely does that. And I always appreciate a uh, good social commentary in a uh, animated film or television show or whatever, or even if it's just uh, regular uh, instead of like forced jokes that are kind of stupid, 
which you get in a lot of uh, live action stuff. So animation actually takes a more uh, a deeper meaning to this stuff, and that's a really good thing that I really enjoy about movies like this. Um, it was just fantastic. I can sing the praises of this movie to the end of the earth. It by no means was a, fa a Disney, like, favorite Disney movie ever, but it definitely was one of the good ones, one of the great ones. <sighs> Creative legacy, eh? I wonder what that even means. Animation, animation research library. I wonder what that means. Uh, Mink and Paint, that's cool. Security, gotta give the security a shout out. We got the special thanks going on. A lot of doctors going on here. And some people that are related to police, that makes a lot of sense. LA Zoo, a lot of wildlife potatoes. Evolutionary biology, that makes sense. Um, women and men of the LA Police Department, North Hollywood Station, of course. Production babies, that's awesome. That's so cool. Video games of it. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. All right, so I'm gonna turn it up in case we have a post-credit scene. So I just turned it back up to uh, 60. I don't know, like all. If there is a post-credit scene, you'll at least get it turned up in time. But I did for myself. We still got a few moments left. I don't think we're gonna get a post-credit scene, but we might. 20 seconds left. Maybe we will. We totally are. Oh no, that's it. How about that? Well. And that's it. Well. I hope you guys enjoyed part one of the... 50,000 subscriber special because it was awesome and I really hope you guys enjoyed this movie as much as I did because Like I said, it was kind of awesome and I already said most of what I want to say about it. So Yeah, I ship it Thanks for watching. Uh, Flaming Shark sign out. Hope you guys have a wonderful fantastical day And I'll see you next time with another video Thanks for watching. Peace